stopping now. Tear them apart! A monitor lizard. They go down! Who will prevail? Does it matter? You deserved it. Jesus! What a waste! Fuck! There we go. It is done. Ooh. Cool. We should move. How do I check how close I am to leveling? Oh my god, I'm so far away. Oh yeah, this is the place where I went just before I decided to stop bothering. Grotus calls me. I feel his pale glow upon my face. Cool. What? <laughs> there we go. Bitches are no longer encumbered. Let's see if I can handle the swarm that's in here. I'll make my own like I thought. May I suggest another way to use this spell? So they walked on. May I suggest another way to use this spell? I stand ready. I can't uh, cast it like that. Blackagorum! Bring it! Holy fuck, it exploded! I did not see that one coming. No, wait. Stop it. I know what's gonna happen. Bane! Come on! Use Bane! Bane the fuck out of them before you all die. Repent. Wait, did they resist Bane? Yeah, but what about... Harem? What did your spell cast do? Oh wait, that's Monitor Lizard.
Did I not cast Bane? Oh, whatever. I'll just cast it again. They're immune to it! Could be worse. And will be. Definitely will be. Fucking. Please. Come on, asshole! Oh, for fuck's sake. Screw it, you can handle a little acid in your face, can't you, Thorkin? Taste the acid. We can do it. With all your Didn't I just kill one of these fucking things? How did I kill it? What did I do? Ah, uh, this is interesting. So you can't deal single target damage to them. No, it's not that button. All right, this should be enough. Shit. Come on! Fucking, you worthless piece of shit. Are you kidding me? Maybe not yet. How do I kill these swarms? Survive. I always survive. Your life ebbs low. Can it be the end? I don't get it. They're immune to ear piercing scream. Okay, so I guess I guess I'll just not bother with this place because I can't seem to kill the fucking swarms. Uh, and of course, yay! So the cave can go fuck itself. No stopping now. Cool.
<sighs> All right. Onwards. Ooh. Five coins to cross the river, huh? Rats. March on. Uh. The corpse's face is bloated from being in the face in the water <laughs> so long. The stench from its toothless mouth is so foul that your eyes begin to water. The hand clenching a sinister looking spear is covered with scabs. Suddenly you feel faint as if a cold wet hand is placed atop on top of your head. Wet hair sticks to his skin and trickles of icy cold water run down your face and shirt. A hoarse whisper rises inside your head. There you are. So it was you who sent me those nightmares. Gurgling, deep-chested laughter pierces your skull, clouding your vision and flooding your ears. All else becomes muffled as if you are trapped underwater. You shake your head to cast off the apparition. Who are you? Davik Nettle. A storm of bright images flashes before your eyes. A long time ago, this person, then a living man, came here from Brevoy, constructed a rope bridge, built a house, and lived in it, collecting payment from those who crossed the river. So he's... he's, a. Uh, a tollman. I don't know what it's called. I guess a bridge troll? How did you die? You see a vision from a lovely spring day. Sunbeams shine warm against your cheeks. Three men approach the house by the, by the bridge. One of them wearing an antlered helm. The Stag Lord. Angry faces, a quarrel, the glint of an unsheathed sword. Suddenly the stag lord's greedy eyes are twisted by surprise. The master of the house has unleashed his hounds! A burning spell stirs. You awake as to the sound of loud barking. Flames are crawling up the walls. The sound of breaking glass, the bitter cold thin air. You are outside, outside the house, and something is wrong. An arrow strikes deep in your shoulder. You hear a guffaw from, of ten throats. You run, already in the middle of the bridge. The man in the antlered helm cuts one of the ropes. An ear-splitting scream fills the air. What do you want from me? You see a vision of a man wearing an antlered helm. You hear a muffled groan and the helm drops to the ground with a loud thud. Your hands are covered with hot blood. Too much blood. Death to the stag lord. Don't you hate it when someone asks you to do something you were already going to do anyway? It makes me want to do nothing just to spite them. Why must I be the one who does it? You feel invisible fingers, cold as stone, draw aside a wet strand of hair from your forehead. What? Can't you kill the Stag Lord yourself? You see the Stag Lord and his cutthroats trying to build a new bridge here. Then running madly away from the rotting monster, the Stag Lord has avoided this place ever since. Yes. I will give you your vengeance, because I'm gonna kill him regardless. The drowned man, who'd been sitting motionless, nods his head. Come later, take the spear. No stopping now. Huh. Is done. What is done? Cool. Hmm. Ratnook Hill? Resting would be nice, don't you think? Hmm. Follow me. Uh How can I 
No, that's not it. Right. An ambush, eh? No stopping now. That's a wild boar. Damn it. Well, it seems we're both evenly matched. You can't hit me and I can't hit you even though we're both standing still. There we go, Amiri. Sinking the boar. Well, Thorkin just said march on, so I guess we march on. <laughs> 